to say a word, I already know your story. You're on the hunt for chocobo greens, am I right? Well, I'd be willing to scratch your back, provided you'd be willing to scratch mine. My casino happens to be plagued by a gaggle of rather eccentric Queensblood players. I'd love it if someone could take them down a notch or two. So, think you're up to the task? I'll handle it. Much obliged. Outlandish though they are, they play a mean game. So mean that it's scaring away my clientele. I need someone to get out there and prove they can be beaten. Got three troublemakers in total. Still looking for action, no doubt. Thanks in advance. Before you go, though, you should take a look at the cards I have for sale. I guarantee they'll come in handy. Get you're here to join me for a drink. Well, aren't you the sweetest little thing? Ugh. You big party pooper. Fine, be that way. Guess we'll play Queen's Blood instead. <laughs> oh no, don't even try to wiggle out of it. Because I'm Mary, darling dear. And when I've knocked a few back, nobody slips through my fingers. So, Either you take a drink, or we play a game. Your choice.
Well, shit. You got me good, hot stuff. Should've had more to drink. I have a confession to make. You see, my dear, even though it's my surefire ticket to victory, I've kind of been cutting back on the booze. Do you want to know why? A while back, I drank way too much, blacked out in the middle of a match, and had an awful nightmare. I dreamed this creepy stranger was trying to chat me up, which is why this match totally doesn't count. I am still off my game. Next time, you better bet I'm gonna be sauced to the max. So watch out, boyo. Congratulations, Cloud. You have attained the rank of Blood Knight. And I have obtained intel on a new opponent for you. There is a somewhat mysterious player by the name of Novalon in North Corel. Having proven yourself as a knight, I believe you can defeat this formidable foe. Everyone avoiding me like the plague! I just wanna... Amazing, isn't it? I don't move a single muscle. Huh? May I help you? I'm in the middle of a performance. Are you? Here to play Queen's Blood? That's going to be tricky. I'm a living statue, you see. I'm not supposed to move under any circumstances. <sighs> Well, I guess I could move my arms, at least. <laughs> You're going to regret making me come to life.
You completely demolished me. Well played, good sir. But my performance wasn't half bad. Wouldn't you agree? Someday, I hope to join the Gold Saucer's grand stable of performers. That's why I'm trying to hone my skills by purposely putting myself in the harshest of environments. But my winning streak was starting to draw negative attention, so maybe losing was for the best. I'll be here for a while yet. If you would like to play another game, just let me know. What's up? What do you want? Oh, I did it again! Hey, sorry, old habit. No harm, men. Please don't go. I'm begging you. I only want to play a game of Queenswood. I promise, that's all. I have a hard time talking to people, and, well, I know I'm not the friendliest looking guy, so I can't convince anyone to go around. Anyway, uh, the name's Pat. You, uh, wanna play with me? Pretty please?
<laughs> that was even more fun than I'd imagined. I've been missing out. Prison ain't a great place to let your car down, you know. So I got into the habit of acting tough and yelling at anyone who looked at me funny. It kept me safe, but it also made good, decent people like you avoid me altogether. Even though I just wanted to play cards. I got so frustrated that no one would give me the time of day that I started to resent the shutty bastards. <laughs> but I've got to change myself first if I want people to talk to me. Because you had the courage to approach me when no one else did. I know that now. So I'm going to do it like you and ask people to play instead of waiting for them to come to me. And there's the man of the hour. Thanks to your efforts. Demand for Queen's Blood is back and stronger than ever. It's at an all-time high. Which means my profits should be too. You did me a great favor. Take this as a token of my thanks. Before you go, though, I have some cards I'd highly recommend for a player as skilled as yourself. You won't want to miss out. People lose interest when they start thinking they can't win. That's why it's important to shake things up once in a while. By the way, don't breathe a word about this to the folks upstairs, unless you want to find yourself behind bars again. And that makes three. Once Pico's had his fill, he'll be ready to hit the track and win us that race. <laughs>